the record was apparently uh, a bit late or was he was delayed he was ex expected at some point and then he was a bit late can you uh, so of course on the internet you've got fans going crazy about all sorts of story maybe you would like to take some time to explain exactly what happened and how come you were late and what is the situation now because a lot of people are wondering in fact well, it's logistical wisely wasn't it mm. really L lots lots of things been asked of of us you know and um, Robert also wanted to make it put his most into it and so we we'd rather hold back and come up with something that everyone loves than and we'd recorded a lot of songs there's a hell of a lot of songs so in order to get them finished um, it just took yeah. more work than I think we anticipated uh, and that was it so eventually, eventually you worked on how many songs roughly just to, to have an idea about 27 and about five instrumental ones I think yeah, it's about 36 wasn't it? all yeah. in them yeah. Mm. None had a name exactly and you were just like playing to find exactly the right ones or did you finish them all and then choose which one were going to be used later? Um, <laughs> we tried to keep everything live so m most, of, um, most of the 36 songs are live takes and then they're being just worked on in small amounts but, so you can leave it till the last minute before you and the arrangements and things yeah. like that, some of the arrangements have changed. Yeah. What's Chops. tended to happen in the past is we've demoed songs mm -hmm. and when we've recorded them for real, we tend to think that the demos had a better energy. Yeah. With Paul coming back, there's obviously a higher level of proficiency there and we, we wanted to keep that the way it sounded and that, that live feel and, you know, the, the the actual backing tracks of the 36 songs, whatever, was done, you know, it, it, it was done in just, just a few weeks. Um, but obviously, with that amount of songs, there has to be a large amount of subject matter that Robert has to then find to ring, uh, write about. But, you know, it's a, it's, that is a problem in itself. Once you had that many songs, you, you said to yourself, OK, we're going to make a double uh, CD. And how did you put that, these songs on one record and others on the other? Yeah, I think, I mean, there's a, a lot of uh, different styles of songs there. And I think it was a question if you're going to have a, a double album with all of them on or just the single with, you know, a, a good... Um, track listing and then kind of building and stuff like because not many people I suppose listen to to albums like that as you know put it on from track one right the way through to track 15 or whatever but that's I think what you know Robert's trying to do is to get it so it has a sort of flow so it was difficult with so many different sort of styles there's some quite slow ones and then there's some quite sort of up poppy ones so did you split the record did, did you split the new double in two like a quiet and uh Upset, or it still hasn't been decided. <laughs> it's not decided. It's, no, it's, the, it's, it's, it's the idea is to do something like that, but it's not definite. Yeah.